Hey guys, this is a uh, quick follow-up video. Um, how do you like my fire? I'm getting ready to make some dinner. Um, already I've had a couple of comments suggesting that it's uh, probably out of the question to suggest such a thing that YouTube create an 18 over or 18 plus policy for live streams. And look, you guys know me, I do my show every Friday, I, I do live streams once a week, and for me, as a, as a live streamer, it's it probably going to be a pain in the ass to have to go through an extra step to verify who I am. But let's be honest, YouTube, Google, they know who you are. They already know who you are. And, and then there's that other aspect of, you know, when there's videos that are inappropriate, they have that little blue button that says, "I, I verify that I, you know I certify that I'm I'm over 18." You click the button, the video plays. So, so there's no real verification process to watch a potentially inappropriate video or potentially offensive. But let's be honest: Do you really think it's asking too much to ask YouTube to? take a step to protect children. Do you really think it's appropriate for children to be live streaming to the entire world unsupervised, in many cases without their parents' knowledge whatsoever? Do you, do you think that's even appropriate? Do you think kids of any age should be able to start a YouTube channel and live stream themselves in their bedrooms and let's be honest, what are kids, what are they uploading? What are they talking about? It's like, oh, what, this is what I'm wearing today. This is what I did today with my friends. I mean, do you really think it's appropriate for children to be interacting with the whole world, the, the world in large, including predators? Is, is there something that can be done in a simple way that could help to protect children from the predators that I mentioned in my previous video. Is there something that you think, is there a solution that you can think of that would be simpler than an 18 over policy? I mean, I'm fully prepared to be wrong on this issue. I'm fully prepared. And for the most part, the comments have been supportive, but I've, I've got a couple of comments that where people were like, sorry, I just don't, I don't think this is feasible. I don't think this is a good idea. So, um, again, I'm serious about the, the, the concept of protecting children. If you think I'm wrong, just let me know.